Hi crafting friends, thanks for stopping by LakeshoreStamping.com. Today I want to share with you this little trinket box that I made and this really neat little paper flower that I put on top of it. To start with, this little container is actually just one of our um, embellishment containers from Stampin' Up! Um, and I just decorated it and turned it into um, something a little pretty. So. Um, the paper flower I'll show you how to do in a minute. Um, I also just put some sticky strip on a piece of our designer series paper to decorate around the edge. You could also use fabric. And then um, our two and a half inch circle punch. Um, I put one on the bottom and um, that's what's inside and one on the top. So let's show you how to make these paper flowers. First of all, you're gonna take the two and three eighths inch scallop circle punch and you're going to punch out five of them, okay? And then you're going to curl up in a, or I'm not curl it up in a ball. You're going to roll it up in a ball, crimple it up in a ball, just kind of crunch it all together as much as you can. And then you're going to flatten them out, or kind of flatten them out. Here's. Here's the other ones I made already. Then you're going to take your paper piercing mat and your paper piercing tool. You're going to put all you're going to stack all 5 of these up. And find the center the best you can and poke a hole all the way through. Then I just took one of our glimmer brads, you're not going to see it, and I um, put it through the hole. Oops. Sometimes they don't want to go in very well. So in that case, you're just going to take, which this is the, this is probably the correct way to do it, take one at a time. I was trying to be quick and fast. You're just going to put one at a time through the hole that you punched. And then, oh, I fasten it in the back. Okay. Then you're just going to take your petals, we can call them petals now, and you're just going to keep scrunching them into the center, one at a time, until you have all five done. And then you'll play with it fifth one in here and you're going to play with it and kind of open it back up a little bit to get your pretty little flower so there you go so I hope you like this and thanks for stopping by LakeshoreStamping.com have a great day